this week we're checking out the Kaleen Green Mamba. Stick around. <music> So this week, we got a pedal from Kayleen. I like Kayleen a lot, and uh, I've done a video with their Blue Sky, which is kind of like their Timmy pedal. I like that one a lot. I've kept it on my board for a while. Also, I did another video with uh, that was about stacking clean boosts, uh, in which I used their White Key pedal, and that was a really cool pedal too. And uh, the nice folks at Kayleen actually reached out to me and asked if I'd like to try out a pedal from their new G series. And uh, I picked out the Green Mamba. And this is a kind of a mid range or a mid focused vintage overdrive pedal. And I, you know, I was really surprised. Really surprised. Um, right out of the box, what I noticed is that I like just, well, it's a small pedal, as you can see, but it's not like other mini pedals that I've had in the past. This is a little bit wider and it's not as narrow, which means that it's not as tall. So what that means is that the knobs can be a little bit more spaced out and the, because the pedal is wider, it actually doesn't rock back and forth. Now, maybe that, you know, it hasn't necessarily been a problem with other pedals, but it's kind of annoying, even if you make sure it's nice and, t you know, you got enough, uh, you know, tape on there, it still can rock back and forth a little bit. But this, because it's a little bit wider, doesn't rock back and forth. Um, and it's, it's uh, yeah, it's really cool. It even comes with a little piece of, of tape, a little grip tape in the box with it which is really cool. I'm looking around for the box. I don't have the box, but anyways, uh, yeah, it does come with a piece of tape so you can just, you know, stick it on, put it right on your board. That's really cool. I haven't seen any other pedal company do that. And it's about 46 bucks right to your door. Uh, you can get it on Amazon and I'll post a link in the info so you can check it out. Anyways, that's enough talking. Let's give it a listen. Green Mamba. Going to be using my Fender Parallel Universe Reverse Telecaster and going right into the UA FX 65 Dream. I'm going to try it out with some different effects as well. Here we go. Clean tone. <laughs> Thank you. 
the slap back. <laughs> with something like a tube streamer. thing for uh, maybe uh, about a little over, over a week now and I've incorporated it into my pedal board here and I gotta say 
I was real. I mean, I know Kayleen makes good stuff, but I'm re this one took me by surprise. Uh, th it's an always on pedal for me. It's it's great. It's a you know anybody who watches this channel knows I love low gain overdrive, like <laughs> very low gain. I like stacking low gain overdrives, but this gives a nice boost uh, with a little bit of grit. Um, it, yeah, it takes it to a really nice place, a really nice sweet spot. And I love how it stacks with my Tube Screamer. And I've actually stacked it with fuzz pedals and distortion and other things, and it sounds good too. I've stacked it with a boost that I'm getting from the 65 Dream, and it sounds great. I like stacking ODs to get my desired dirty tones and this gives me a very very good starting uh, starting point and I think it's gonna stay on my board for a really long time thank you Kayleen I want to thank them so much for uh, reaching out and asking me to test out uh, this pedal it's awesome and for 46 bucks you can't lose I did find <clears throat> excuse me the box this is a cool little box that it comes with and look at that a little piece of tape for you, cut perfectly to fit your pedal. I've never seen anybody else do that. That's pretty rad. Anyways, the Kayleen Green Mamba from their G-Series. Uh, it's very cool. You get it on Amazon. Check it out. Thank you very much for watching. I appreciate you coming back here. Um, if you have any questions about this pedal or if you have any questions about the gear used in this video, feel free to uh, leave a comment, leave a thumbs up if you like what you saw here. Um, go ahead and subscribe if you haven't done that already. Thank you for very much for watching to the end. I appreciate that. And we'll see you next time.